Hi, it's Roberto Mickey, and we're going to be showing some data on the Air Queen Nano Mask. Here's a plug for the channel. Hit subscribe and hit like to help out this channel. These are some photos of the packaging, both from the front and the back. Here's a picture of the mask on our mannequin head, and you can see that it has ear loops, which go around the ears to hold the mask on your face. The mask fit is not exceptionally tight, and there's plenty of room for air to escape through the sides. So to test the mask, we mounted the mask on the casing for a ventilator filter. So this allows us to test the filtration efficiency of the mask filter material. This is a video of us testing the number of particles in the ambient air around our particle counter. And we averaged around 3,114.3 micron particles over 10 trials. This is a video of us testing the air going through one of these nano masks and we averaged approximately 369.3 micron particles over 10 trials through the nano mask. We wanted to do an additional control and so we actually tested a KN95 that we had and we did it over 10 trials as well and we tested the 0.3 micron channel and we averaged around 6.25 particles over those 10 trials. In, with the KN95. So based on the data that we collected, the filtration efficiency for the Air Queen Nano Mask was 88% for its material. The KN95, on the other hand, its filtration material had a 99.8% filtration efficiency, which means that independent of the fit of the mask, the KN95 did have a better filtration efficiency than the Air Queen Mask. So unfortunately, I can't really say that the Air Queen Mask is an N95 or anywhere even close to the equivalency is probably more the equivalency of a regular face mask.